Hi, welcome back. In this lecture, we'll create Spring Boot project for Wikimedia Producer. Well, basically, we want to create a multi-module Maven project. Within that, we create a sub-module. All right. So first, we'll create a Spring Boot project using Spring Initializer, and then we'll import that project in IntelliJ IDEA, and then we'll create sub-modules within that project. So let's go to browser, and in a new tab, just type start.spring.io. This will bring up Spring Initializer. Let's go and let's fill up the project information over here. So here we have two types of project, Marvin and Gradle. So let's keep Marvin project as selected and choose language Java and Spring Boot version 2.6.7. So as of now, it is 2.6.7, but it may differ in your case. All right, next let's fill up the project metadata over here. So let me give group as net.java guides and then artifact something like spring boot kafka real world project something like this and this is the description so name is same as artifact and description is demo project for spring boot and kafka and package let's give net.javagate.spring boot all right and packaging let's keep jar so basically we want to create a parent Marvin parent project but we need to change the packaging type as a POM so we'll do it later as of now let's select packaging as a jar and Java version let's keep 11 as selected you can choose Java 8, 11, 17, 18 as per the JDK installation on your machine but let's keep default that is Java 11 as selected next let's go to the dependency section over here click on add dependencies and here we are going to choose kafka dependency for spring application so let's type spring for kafka and there we go so this is the spring for apache kafka dependency which will provide support to integrate apache kafka in a spring based applications so let's choose this dependency okay so this dependency is enough for us so also let's choose the lombok dependency to reduce the boilerplate code so let me choose this dependency all right perfect if you want to explore you can go ahead and explore this project by using explore option so you can just go to pom.xml and you can just review whatever the dependency that you have added okay we have added you know spring for kafka dependency as well as lombok dependency okay just close it and go ahead and click on generate button so this will generate this spring boot project as a zip file all right let's open this zip file in a folder and then let's unzip this file so let me unzip it perfect now let's open the IntelliJ idea so i'm going to open the IntelliJ idea over here and here you can see a couple of options new project open get from cvs so we are going to open the existing project in the IntelliJ idea so let's go ahead and click on open over here and then let's go to the location where your Spring Boot project is downloaded. So in my case, it is downloads folder. So select it and click on open. So this will open up Spring Boot project in the IntelliJ IDEA. All right. Now we have generated Spring Boot application using Spring Initializer and imported that project in the IntelliJ IDEA. Let's make this Spring Boot project as a multi-module Marvin project. Okay. So let's go and let's make the necessary changes to make this project as a multi-module Maven project. So first of all, we need to make this project as a parent project, right? So go to the pom.xml and we need to add a packaging tag over here. So just add a packaging tag and let's give value as pom. Okay, so whenever we create a multi-module Maven project, we have to provide packaging type as a pom for a parent project. Okay, now we are good to create a sub modules within this parent project okay just save it and just go to this icon here and just load the Marvin changes okay now the parent project is ready now let's go ahead and let's create a module within this parent project so right click on this project new and then choose module and check tick mark this and then click on next and then give module name as Kapka producer wikimedia and then click on finish so this will create a 
module within this parent project so you can see as soon as we create a module within this parent project a pom.xml will be updated so you can see here just open the pom.xml of parent project and if you can see this tag over here modules section will be added in a pom.xml and you can see the module okay so just go ahead and click on this icon to load the maven changes okay now we have created kafka producer wikimedia module within this parent project well if you can observe this module that we have created within this parent project this module project is not a spring boot project so let's make this module as a spring boot project so let me quickly create a package and let's name it as net.javaguides.spring boot and let's create a spring boot main entry point class within this package right click new and then choose class and let's give class name as spring boot producer application all right perfect and let's annotate this class with add spring boot application annotation and let's have a main method within this class all right and within a main method let's call spring application and then call static method run method and then just pass spring boot producer application dot class okay that's it now we have created spring boot main entry point class for this module okay so if you can run this spring boot project it should work and there we go there is no error in a console right so what we have done so far we have created a parent project and within that parent project we have created a module and we have made this module as a spring boot project okay so in order to verify this spring boot project setup what we can do is we can go to marvin over here and from here we can just run the command marvin clean install okay and let's see whether the setup is correct or not and here we go the marvin build success it means that the multi-module marvin project that we have created is working as expected okay so one more thing we are missing here we need to make this kafka producer wikimedia module as a jar file so go to pom.xml of this module and let me minimize this and here let's give packaging type as a jar so let's give packaging as a jar for this module and save it and click on this load marvin changes and let's again build this multi-module marvin project so just run marvin clean install and there we go it means that the multi-module mine project that we have created is working as expected all right in next lecture we'll see how to configure kapka producer all right i will see you in the next lecture